Hey there. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we're going to... So in today's video, we're going to be doing a uni room tour. So yeah, I will be showing you my room. If you didn't already know, I'm studying at the University of Manchester and I'm doing my degree in psychology and I am actually staying in halls for my first year. First of all, this room is so much nicer than where I stayed last time. I actually started uni last year and then dropped out, but this is a massive improvement and I'm very grateful to be here. I did just also want to say that my decorating skill is not skill. My decorating style is a little bit chaotic so it might not be to your taste but I quite like it this way and it makes me feel more at home. So yeah I'm just gonna start off by showing you everything in my room like a glance and then I'll go through and actually show you everything. So yeah I hope you enjoy this video. Uh, I just tried to do like a whole general view of my whole room but it doesn't really look great so I'm just gonna show it you from <laughs> this angle I think. Okay, so first thing that you see when you come into my room is this open wardrobe area. So what I did was just put like my nicest looking clothes here. It looks a bit rough at the moment, but hey, uh, down here I've got my shoes. Quite a few are also hidden under my bed, but yeah, these are like the main ones I've left out because they look okay. And this is my doorstop called Oswald, <laughs> just in case you wanted to know. Um, and up here is where I put all the things that I don't want to deal with. Yeah, in here is all my clothes and yeah, it doesn't look great. I'm not gonna lie to you, but yeah, I love having all this storage. So my least favorite part in the sense that it's hard to make look nice is this area. So up here, I've got Connor's clothes and some of the books we've been given for our course. Underneath, I have the makeup that I tend to use the most, which is in this big bag thing all my skincare stuff and like hair care stuff right at the back. Next is all the makeup that I don't use a lot and all my lipsticks are here too. And then I just have this microwavable warm guy <laughs> just here to make it look a little bit more interesting. But yeah, I, I have had like an issue with these just because they're so tall and it's hard to sort of fill up the space. So everything kind of looks a bit empty, but yeah, and then down here is probably my least favourite part. It's actually where I've got all of my toiletries and it's not all. These are my mostly used toiletries just because there isn't any storage inside the bathroom. So I've just kind of got it here. And then under there, I just have my backpack and some fizzy drinks. And yeah, they're, you know, it's whatever. Then I've got my mirror, which I'm so happy that I finally have a mirror. Well, a long mirror so I can actually see what I look like before I leave the house. So yeah, it's just a big mirror and it reveals the secret shoes that no one should be able to see. So yeah, and then next to that I have my dream catcher from Corfu that I got this year and I guess after that we can move on to my desk. This is my desk is in its entirety. <laughs> so underneath I have my bin which is actually an Aldi bag <laughs> and then the recyclable bin thing that the uni gave us. It's so useful to have an actual separate bin for paper and plastics and stuff. I really really appreciate it so yeah and on my desk well i suppose next to my desk i have this big tv which we tend to use by just putting it on top of the chair and then we'll sit in the bed and watch tv or whatever this is the tv that i keep on my desk which is a lot smaller and fits much nicely uh <laughs> there's my playstation my controller hard drive all of that shenanigans <laughs> Uh, then I've got my laptop, pencil case, all of my stationery, which looks very chaotic and messy, and it kind of is. Then I've got my desk fan. This room gets so hot and I didn't bring my fan from home, so I'm just sort of dealing with that. It's not very powerful. It's a bit <laughs> not great, but anyway, yeah. Then I've got my books, my nail varnish, my lamp. That's the next thing. And I just got this from one from Ikea last year. But yeah, then I have got my little pins and there is actually a dinosaur in there, but I don't think he wants to say hello. So they give us a big board to sort of like stick notes and pictures and all sorts on. But I've at the moment got my jewelry on there. So I've got all my necklaces, my hoop earrings, 
Then next to that I've got more earrings. A lot of them are just actually stuck into the board rather than like being hooked on pins. Then I've got this little postcard from a plant shop where I actually got my plants. <laughs> But yeah, the back of it looked nice, so I was like, I'll just spice up my board. Uh, then I've got my pins, which are all stuck here. I was thinking of actually sticking these on my bag, but I think they look better here. So I've got two pins from Audra Eau and another two pins from Hannah Kinnart. Then I've got Fallout pins. That's from Urban Outfitters, Kenji, all of the like little silly ones. And yeah, my friend got me that one, so I don't really that one so i'm not really sure where it's from but yeah that's my desk Boop. Uh, i'm not actually going to go through what's inside these drawers just because it's boring like this is miscellaneous stuff slash stuff that i hide so that i don't have to deal with it socks knickers you know you get the idea <laughs> then in this little area i have my like this is what i mean it kind of looks a bit messy but i like it this way i think it looks good so um I've got my books, uh, so they're art books, I've got like a comic, a Rick and Morty comic, a psychology book, and then what I like to call my demic books, which are kind of like, you know, how to be human, how to be confident, how to be happy, stuff like that. Then I've got this little weird guy, Audra Eau Claire's art books at the back. <laughs> Two mugs which are damaged and can't be drank out of, so this one's got all my scrunchies in it, you know? Yeah, and then I've got my paintbrush holder which is a cactus, some cherubs from um, Corfu and this creepy little guy. Uh, I had to buy him, I think he was a Mother's Day present but obviously I got him for myself. And then I've got the anatomy thing just holding him there because if he's not there then he will not stay. And then I've got my PlayStation games there too. This one's a bit less chaotic but I don't really like this one as much. So yeah, at the back I've just got my books. I've got a statue of Athena from Corfu, sorry. Then a picture of my dad and me, uh, which is like the only picture that I actually have. I've got a little pot of earrings and rings and then this is my plant called Graham inside of this pot which I got from Tesco. A little woodlouse teddy, don't ask, and some more books. So yeah, that is my desk. Then literally up here, I just have this like divider for paper and this is genuinely where I put things that I do not want to deal with or talk about. Notes, letters, anything that I just don't want to look at ever again, I just put up there. <laughs> then I've got my shark, bear, a mug with lights in and my printer. So yeah, that's that little area. Then Connor's PlayStation and controllers and all of that are there. And I've got my little like, <laughs> I guess decoration is just here. Those two are from TK Maxx and that's from Sainsbury's and that's just some water pop but they're the same colour so I thought I'd put them together, you know? <laughs> Up here I've just got some art prints that I bought from artists and I'll put their names on the screen. Above my bed I've got a big Stranger Things poster. Uh, I actually watched that this year and I'm honestly just in love with it so big poster there. And then my bed. <laughs> My precious bed. So I I was lucky enough to get a, a three quarter bed. Yeah, I've, this is my favorite bedding that I own and I don't know where I got it from. And then I've got a blanket, my shark from Ikea, my bunny from Kenji, and then this pillow that um is not looking great. But Connor got me that for our anniversary, so yeah. Then in here, I've got, it's just sort of like decoration. You know, you can see it. It's just like a salt rock lamp, Teddy and you know, all sorts, but this is where things get left and charged. So my phone's there and then like a glass of water and stuff. So here I've got all my like hidden things. So this is where I put my snacks um, and vitamin C tablets. And then down here is where all my toiletries are, along with paracetamol and a sewing kit for when my clothes get broke, because they do. And that's my, that's my dirty washing bag. But anyway, lastly, uh, is just the little area up here, which is, I guess just decoration. I've got these lights which look very cute. I had them in my room at home, so it's just good to put them to actually good use. And some art prints up here, which I'll put the name of the artist up. Yeah, this is Albert. Um, he's kind of dying, I'm not gonna lie. I really shouldn't own plants because I'm terrible. And then I've just got some vodka, shot glasses, water, which I should really drink, but I just end up giving it to my plants because I leave it too long. A chapstick. I've got a little bear lamp that lights up from Kenji and a humidifier that I got off eBay. And then more glasses. So yeah, I guess that's my room. <laughs> And this is my bathroom, but I'm really not going to go into detail with it because honestly it needs cleaning and I'm not in the right space to do it today. <sighs> so yeah, that is my entire room. I hope you enjoyed this video and like how my room looks, I guess. But anyway, yeah, I will see you next week, hopefully for a spooky video. So yeah, bye. Hey there. <laughs> hey.
Hey there. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. Ow. Hello. Welcome to my channel.